Hello Taurus, welcome to the channel. This is Kelsey from Empress of Energy, ready to jump into a current energy check for you gorgeous bulls, you babies, you diamonds, you angels. Um, how are you? I hope you are well. If you are new, do join the family and subscribe. If you are returning, hi. I hope you're all doing great during this super moon. So, come on in. Current energy as usual, just cleansing the energy. I've already meditated and pre-shuffled, okay? <clears throat> so just give that a little bit of a cleanse. Um, I'm just gonna get to the juice, I'm just gonna get to the tea, because I am gonna do a bonus just super moon reading, okay, for anyone. Not just for Tauruses, but for all. Anyone feeling drawn, okay? <clears throat> You've got, um, listen, what I seen in the pre-shuffle, yeah, was that like, you are quite the mystery at the moment, Taurus. Something about yourself, all of yourself, anything that you're doing, especially if it comes to your finances or working out or, you know, something that you are having a glow up with in some kind of way, you're doing it as like quite a mystery and you've got people chattering about it. Um, show me Taurus's messages, please. Oh, just be mindful of some of you having a child that's telling people your business as well. Um, oh my God, you're about to get into a very stable commitment. I kept seeing the Hierophant in the pre-shuffle. And for a lot of you, this is someone that you have either ghosted or someone that ghosted you. Someone's coming back around. And it's showing up as a celebration. Um, and now I've got the dog, the sun, and the anchor. And again, still the, the house and the book, which is just pure privacy. So keep it to yourself. You're about to get in something quite long lasting, settling down. Some of you, this is about your profession, your work, your career. Um, even that is, you're keeping that, you, you know, your recipes to yourself. You're keeping your secrets to yourself. Um, it's going to bring you success. And, but there's someone loyal along the way. Um, but others of you, this is a relationship. Mm -hmm. Show me Taurus's energy, please. Show me Rising and Venus. But there's been some form of Five of Pentacles, um, what I've seen in Tarot whilst I was pre-shuffling. So there's been some kind of pause, some kind of gap, ghosting, um, no communication. There's been something. Or someone's... If anyone's lost the job, you're about to get a better one. But that won't be for everyone. Show me messages for Taurus, please. Some me and Venus. Look, the tree, card number five. This is the past. Health, growth, spiritual, vitality, karma from the past. Wanting a new beginning. The stark. Change, movement, new beginnings, transition, flexibility, transformation. Someone from your, from your past is going through a transformation. Um, and they're returning to you. It's showing up as a three of cups moment though, so show me messages for Taurus. Oh shit, and what I did see as well was your twin flame literally watching you off. So for some of you, this is your twin flame. Um, but there's been a pause, there's been a gap. Show me messages for Taurus, please. Show me rising and Venus. So place a sign of Taurus in your birth chart, of course, any way you like. You could find messages in here for you. Crosswatch is always welcome. Flip the rolls as you need to. Do what you need to do with the messages, but don't force them if they're not for you, okay? We got the man. No gender, but for a lot of you, this is some kind of divine masculine and going through a transformation. Going towards a new beginning. Someone from your past is returning. Hold on to your hats until the 28th. Even then, we've got a couple of weeks shadow period, which some say is stronger than the retrograde itself. So, I mean, I'm just trying to make you feel better, but someone from your past is returning. Some of you, this is a friendship thing. Um, but for a lot of you, it's not. Give me one more. What do my Tauruses need to see? Oh my. It's not. <laughs> I was, you know, trying to keep it widespread. But it's not. It's about a commitment. There's someone wants to come and reconcile. They just really, really do. This is someone that you've matured from. Or like, found wisdom. There was a lesson learned in the situation that you had with this person. Like within that abandonment or the ghosting or something, there was something that you had to learn. There was something that you, some kind of form of wisdom that you gained um, or maturity, growth that you gained from this person. And the majority of you are that this person.
in this retrograde, it's because you've learned whatever lesson you was meant to. So it's now showing up as a clover, you know? Oh, oh you're going to doubt it. You're going to like, oh, fuck. You're going to be like, oh, my God. Um, you're going to be a bit confused. Or there's going to be like an um, unclarity, doubt, worry, uncertainty. But it's showing up as abundance. Oh, Oh my God, a lot of you have got so much sneaky shit surrounding your finances. It's actually a joke. Um, especially those of you that work in like um, a group setting. Don't think that them people are your friends because they are not. They will throw you under that bus at any given opportunity. Yeah, there's someone around you like that and it's to do with your business, your finances, your, your gains, your abundance. Those of you, it's not at work. It's just about how amazing you are. Someone can't stand how like divinely protected you are or how abundant you are you know just naturally just be mindful it's somewhat around you or most, multiple people for some of you but most definitely at least one and that person is trying to possibly steal or they have done and they may be nervous about you finding out right now something's going on there Whoops. Oh, silly me. Show me Taurus energy. Some of you are coming into money. Wow. Look, honestly, those of you that have lost finances or because some of you it might be your loss, but there's something better. And for the, the majority of you though, it's someone else's loss of some sort. But it's been divinely guided. Like it's showing up as great for you. Or the gap, the pause. Like again, you've learned the right lessons, you've done something. Uh, that the divine wanted you to do. Do you know what I mean? Be different for all of y'all, but there's some kind of big abundance on its way. Some of you, it's in money, like monetary value. Um, some of you, it's in assets, or some of you, it's just a feeling of being rich. You know, abundantly blessed. Someone's watching you. Well, winning, yeah. So this, you may have some, some, had some like recent victory or win or recognition. You know, graduation, um, some kind of yes moment. Someone's been watching you do that. Your twin flame, to be exact, has been watching you celebrate or watching you win. Some of that's not been easy though, as well. And if, so, for a lot of you, they knew what you, they knew what that what you was going through, what kind of battle you was going through, maybe, um, and they've seen you complete it successfully. Slightly proud, in a way. Or someone's coming in proud because they've completed a s battle successfully, a cycle, a chapter. Someone's family member could be going to jail. Seeing some strange messages today. Show me messages for Taurus, please. I mean, I did ask for the juice, so... Someone could be going to jail, someone within a group, or... A family member, like, show me messages for Taurus, please. Privileged lady, yep. Honestly, you're doing great. Whatever you're doing, you're doing great. Oh my God, it's about to get better. Jeez. You are someone's, like, they look at you in admiration like you are someone's kind of everything like someone's big time in the fields because i've seen the king of cups in the pre-shuffle and the way that, that that man is looking at that privileged lady there it's like from afar though maybe still or it has been um take the time as it resonates past is a minute ago and prior future is in a minute and beyond and very fluid so if this hasn't happened yet this is possibly to come um, but someone's looking at you in like I just gotta have you. <laughs> like, right, we've got community, main male and main female. Oh my god, something's about to go public. <gasps> Guys, you're about to get in a public situation, relationship with the majority of yours, commitment, the ring, the main male, main female, together. But there's this community, so this is that like group of people here that are being made of you and another. Like, and it's, it's good. It's like, maybe you're going to get seen out. 
or like someone's just going to make it known to whoever these people are. Official. Someone's making something official with you. Um, or doing something uh, official to be able to come towards you. Um, documents. Could be in a courthouse, a legal situation, you know. Oh, there is. There's a Divine Feminine. There is a fake-ass Divine Feminine. Majority of you, you work with this person. Or they are just trying to fuck up your plans in some kind of way. I don't know if it's connected to this person. For some of you it is, for some of you it isn't. Place it as you need to. But there's a there's a false, there's a fake ass divine feminine. Um it's like trying to make you doubt yourself, question yourself, fuck up your work. Or your plans. They want you like that. It's not gonna happen. But they're trying their hardest, like, wow, it's a bit weird. Like, they're actually grafting, like, fuck, yeah, to fuck you over. Wow. I mean, silly goose. Whatever the reason. You may know, the runner. Wow. Is missing you. The runner is missing you. You've got a runner missing you. I told you. It's someone from the past. But they want to make it known. Healing from heartbreak. Freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. So. I don't want to say for a minute. This is someone that you freed yourself from. It could be. For some of you. But it's showing up too beautiful. Maybe. Like, do you know what I mean? I mean I'm all about people changing. But. Karmic's karmic. So for a lot of you. It's someone getting out of that themselves. And coming towards you. Or you're getting out of one. Um, and going towards another. There's two separate situations, put it that way. Yeah, someone's not been showing the true feelings. Wearing a mask. Hiding. Pretending. Maybe for quite some time. Yeah, a lot of you was some kind of other woman or other dude and it was sabotaged. Some could have gone to shit, some could have gone like boom, explosion, you know. The truth could have come out. Someone was fucking someone over and the truth came out. Show me messages for Taurus, please. Some me rising of Venus. Listen, some of you might be in that situation right now. You're going to get found out. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, I love you and I don't judge, but you are going to get found out in some way. Stabbed in the back, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. So maybe this has already happened because there's time that's needed. Clock. Need time, takes time, in time, cycles, time to heal, progress. Oh, before they can reach out, yeah. Someone's got to do something, go for a separation, uh, deal with some uh, deception, shocking attack. Someone could have been attacked, or I don't know. Someone, and then heart with a K, geez. Someone's had to go through something. Maybe they've been attacked. Maybe they've been. I don't know, but they've had to go through something. Maybe a bit of a taste of their own medicine. Especially if this is someone that you, once upon a time, was completely in love with, committed to, and they fucked you over. They could have had a taste of their own medicine and they're coming back around. But that won't, that may be for one of you. That's not for everyone. This is someone getting that out of their own situation and going towards another. You, for the, for the majority of you that I'm, you know, connecting with, someone is getting out of a situation... And coming towards you and you know who that person is they're a runner and they're healing the heart they're getting out of a toxic situation and are you are flip it as you need to oh some of you have manifested this it's like someone doesn't deserve to be where they are they just don't whether that's you or, or, or cross watch or you don't deserve to be in the karmic bullshit like frustrating self-sabotaging like confidence affecting nonsense you don't need to be there and you the divine is throwing someone right in in your face to make you realize that a lot of you that's already happened and now this is round two but it's going to be real 
known public. Mm -hmm. Let's get tarot. Let me know if this is making sense. Hello, the Queen of Wands. She's looking very desirable right now. Very much so. The Six of Wands. Some of you are really winning at some Some of you have got fire in your chart. Are you dealing with a fire sign? The Emperor. Aries energy. Then husband. Always. Divine masculine. No gender. So this could absolutely be a wife. Um... Someone's never left, right, let go of the connection. They just haven't. I hope I don't get penalised for that. Balls. Um, you're really going to consider this in some kind of way. Are you being told to? Uh, the Seven of Pentacles and the Three of Swords because of what was. Um, and how you've grew from it. What you've gained from it. You don't want to jeopardise that. Weren't this in a reading not long ago? Trust your intuition, guys. Always. Mm, some of you are arguing with your own intuition. intuition. Um, I mean, it looks beautiful. Four of Wands, Ten of Cups, Strength. Just be careful how you manifest, you know. Show me, <clears throat> this is what you've manifested, so just be careful how you manifest going forward. Um, if you have a negative mindset around someone that you are going to continue with and try and convince yourself otherwise, the universe ain't going to listen to them, right? The universe ain't going to be convinced. You will still manifest a non-committal energy. Um, so just bear that in mind, yeah? Show me messages for Taurus, please. Show me Rising and Venus. You know, the Seven of Pentacles for me is evaluation. It's wondering whether you want to get in, in this commitment, can it work? Can it be stable? Can we build upon it? Can it have stability, longevity? You could absolutely be dealing with another earth sign, another Taurus. Oh, why are you so... You've manifested this and now you're questioning the fuck out of it. So just be careful how you go. Can it work? There could be a friend involved in some kind of way. Um, Leo and Ajay, the son. Can we be happy? Can this work? That's the result. So happiest card in tarot. Also, exposure, truth. There's a third party situation dying or a situation dying because of a third party situation. Um, someone wants to be with another, I'm telling you now. So place that as you need to. And a lot of you, it's the Divine Masculine. Let's clarify. Let's clarify. It's like maybe for some of you, if this is your ex-spouse, yeah, they've got themselves in a karmic situation. It worked like yours was karmic. Like, maybe you see it as such now. Um, but they, they've they this they've lamped themselves into, like, landed themselves into some karmic situation and they, they're coming back. Because they're your twin flame. Because I've seen your twin flame watching you. So, but there's a karmic situation somewhere in all of it. So I'll take it as, you, take it, as it resonates. Top and bottom is they're coming back. <laughs> Possibly at night time. Or they're going to just send, you know, just press send, send that risky message. Um, again, anyone that is sending messages, you are going to get caught. You may have already have done. The five of ones. Someone's arguing with the past, with their ex or with someone from the past. Hmm. Some of you, you don't see this going on. You can just feel it. Could be dealing with a cancer. And again, a lot of you have got people from your past really quizzing the fuck out of, not you, because you're not giving nothing away, but each other, like, there's a lot of jealousy. Competition for some of you. Maybe one of your, maybe someone that you know from the past is in serious competition with you. Don't think you know about it. But they can't work you out or what you do out or how you do it. They can't work it out. And they see you as no better than them. Do you know what I mean? They see them as better than you. But they can't work out why you're doing better. So they're jealous as fuck. So just pay attention to that. I don't know why it keeps showing up. Um. <laughs> In some kind of way. 
Show me the Seven of Pentacles, please, the Taurus. What is this? But it's a valuation, no, it's... Is it worth it, the Six of Pentacles? Uh, you know what, again, once upon a time when this... Whenever in the past, you put too much into it, or you put more than the other person did. It was imbalanced. You know, you could have felt quite silly. The Knight of Wands and the Ten of Swords. You are not going to trust any form of words, I'll put it that way. Actions only. Actions only is what you're going to listen to, not words. That could, again, be advice. You're going to get told that something's over. Or someone that fucked you over is coming back around. They're just going to do it. They're just going to press sand. And the ten of swords. So... Someone's going to either reach out and say, I've done it. Or it's someone that has fucked you over, reaching out to you. Again, you've manifested this, though. You have. Film with the Gemini. Show me this hierophant, please. Seven of Pentacles wanted to come out again then. So this is all about you getting in a relationship with this person. So whatever was once was in the past, you're gonna question the fuck out of it, gonna you know it's is it gonna happen again? Um But I feel like the only maybe you're in your own way. I feel like there is an actual energy um in your way in some kind of way, but maybe as far as this is concerned, because I've just spoken about the negative manifesting. Just maybe you're being told here just to not be in your own way. You know? Show me this hierophant, please, the Taurus. Oh, the Queen of Cups, the Nine of Cups. So this is someone that you want, but you see him as quite selfish, maybe. Show me one more. The Three of Wands with the time. You don't want someone to be selfish with the time. Or the time that they give you. Um, so again, it's just the past being brought back up. There's been something about a weight, and it's like... Because that Nine of Cups is quite a selfish Nine of Cups. So it's like, how did you have... How could you have all these feelings for me and still wait all that time? You know? Correct me if I'm wrong, but Taurus is a big on fake. So it's like, that's the level of fakeness to you. The Sun, the Four of Cups, the Three of Swords. There's something about time. Hmm. Show me this Eight of Pentacles, please, for Taurus. I feel like this person's got the answers, though. You know? Show me this eight of pentacles, please. Or oh, they've even got something to show you. It's like, this is why. Um, in some kind of way. Show me this eight of pentacles, please. Wow, justice. The tower. Jesus. Uh, someone's mask is getting blown off. Whoever was wearing that mask, it's getting blown off. It could be a Libra or a Scorpio. But this is just... Um, one more, the Eight of Pentacles. The Page of Swords. That Page of Swords looks pierced off. Someone could have, someone could have seen something or found something out. Um, at someone's work or whilst they was working or what they, so this person's watching you while you work this person's seen something and it's making it or they found something out or something's been found out and it's making it's having the tower blown off do you know what i mean and that's karma that's karmic clear perfect as far as the divine's concerned with justice there that's balance um but again, there's something about you and <clears throat> time and having like a slight issue with it. Like 
it's like we'll have healed so much now it's like i've grew like i said at the beginning show me what this actually let's see what the tower is show me this tower the nine of swords there's someone there stressing someone else the fuck out there's gossip about you so someone could have heard something maybe your twin flame they found or they've seen something they've seen something and it stressed them out show me this page of swords Ace of Cups, Judgment, listen, um, there's a reconciliation coming around here, but there's the Queen of Swords right there. Like, in the way of what you want, so take that as you will. Because that's you in the star energy. It could be an Aquarius, or you're dealing with an Aquarius, whatever, but this Queen of Swords is in the way of you, this reconciliation, and the star. So, hmm. Show me this page of swords, please. The eight of wands. Someone's found messages. Like I'm telling you now. Someone could have found someone's find someone's gonna find messages if they haven't already. Like some it's mm. It's like someone's gonna have no choice but to take the mask off. Literally. Because someone's been caught. Fire Manager, Gemini, the King of Wands, the Lovers, the Two of Cups, the Queen of Wands, wow, the High Priestess, and the Seven of Swords. Oh, what, what is that? Trust your intuition, Seeker. Honestly, for some of you, you don't even know that you're in the situation right now, but you feel like you are. If you've got that feeling that you're a side piece, you are. Trust your intuition. This for some of you, this is already you already found out that way. And it's that person coming back. You already found out intuitively that you was a side piece. Um because messages were found. Show me this two of pentacles, please. The page of wands. Oh, here to fuck about again, are we? The high priestess, the king of swords and the high priestess. So, um, trust your intuition about whatever this person is saying. I'm going to clarify. Um, but it, the two of pentacles are like, oh, you're just here to say what it is that you need to say to get what you want. Or something like that. What the devil, Hierophant, somebody obsessed with you. And again, there's a toxic situation in the way of your commitment. A lot of you rightly don't give a fuck anymore, to be honest. <laughs> I love that fire. Show me this High Priestess, please. Show me this High Priestess, the Hermit. So someone's going to come and tell you that they grew up, they've matured, they've seen the light, they've gone within, you know, they've done some reflecting, they've... whatever, with a Hermit. It could be a Virgo. Trust your intuition on that. The Empress, the Four of Pentacles. So you want this and the Three of Cups. But there's just a very negative summit surrounding it. So, show me this Three of Pentacles, please. The Four of Wands, the Three of Cups. Give me one more. And the Ten of Pentacles. Listen, a friend here could actually get involved in the good way. Or something, listen, if there's no friend or family member on it and the kind of mutual party getting involved to get you two to come together, um, they're actually having the balls to come and approach you themselves and they are going to give you every suggestion in the world that they feel like you need in order for this to be able to work and they're going to win you over, put it that way. The Four of Wands, the Three of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles, that's beautiful. Some of you could work with this person. Um, or it's like a mutual friend thing. Or it's just the ability to work together and have this. Because let's be honest, every relationship takes work. So. The two of Pentacles, the wheel. You're going to feel like you're being tested. <laughs> you can't win, can you? It's tight. Um, the only advice I can give.
it's like you're very divinely protected anyway so either way that you go whichever decision you make whichever way you decide to proceed you can't fail again we've got the sun here happiness so you're very divinely protected so you know just remember that when it comes to how do i go forward if you want to do it but you do you're a little bit apprehensive or there's some reason especially to do with that devil energy and the toxic bullshit if that's the reason why you're not going to go forward do not let that hold you back do not let that hold you back whatever that may be show me this sun wow listen so the emperor the five of cups the emperor the four of cups so this energy here this divine masculine needs to see you leaving needs to feel your loss they need to have had that space you know like i said at the beginning they've had that space to integrate something is that the right word like to process how they feel what the fuck happened how they dealt with it and how they've lost you and you know revelation it's like someone it's like they didn't deal with the situation good enough or obviously i mean that's pretty much a given but they never took account for that or they'd never admitted that or something like that i'm gonna clarify the five of cups it could be something about a holiday or a trip that's significant um if those of you that have been on holiday or anything of the start recently and you put pictures online they've been seeing them show me this five of cups please what the king of cups they love you they love you very much they've just they've needed some something to feel it and to see you leaving like this missed opportunity that ship is sailing there's no cups left stood up you know that's how they're seeing this situation so it's look at all that drama with someone from the past though this could be you, but I don't feel like it is. The five of stars, the five of ones, and the six of cups. It could be a family member. Again, it could be your family member. I take it as it resonates. Someone's past is holding them seriously back on a very, very, very sly level. Hmm. Let's get you some angel answers. Not the right time. Something was not the right time. Mm-mm-mm. You giving too much, you give too much, the situation will improve. I feel like you did too much first time round. And then just, there was a big disaster in some kind of way. Success. So, I feel like you believe that now. It wasn't the right time. You know, you've accepted that. You found the lessons within the situation. You're ready. Oh, okay. Within the next few weeks, take action, opportunity. Be assertive. Yes. If you want it, have it. Don't let nothing hold you back, you know, from anything. Two minutes. One at a time. One at a time, please. Messages for Taurus. Somebody rising and Venus. <laughs> well. Yes. No. And trust peaceful resolution you're gonna argue with yourself maybe even argue with your angels um but trust your intuition don't go against it you know some of you are going to be in the position to want to say yeah and then you're going to talk yourself out of it because you don't trust you know but there can be a peaceful resolution here choose a new direction yes be assertive opportunity take action Again, it's all about how you go into it. Do you know what I mean? If you go into it with a negative mind frame, it's going to go to shit. Do you know what I mean? It just is. Um, but you've got it about you now, given what you've been through and the lessons that you've already learned. You've gone, you know how to do that different. So it's whether, you've, it's whether you want to. Do you know what I mean? Um, but someone is in love with you. <laughs> well, this is what we've got. Let me know if that made sense. Like, like, share, comment and subscribe if you are new. I love you all so much. You know this. I'll see you in the next one. Mwah.